Just very briefly, uh, Mr. Speaker, say, uh, I, I think the honourable members on the other side need to understand that this is, this is a repeal of two bills. We are not making a new law. Uh, what we are saying is that both the, the laws that we are trying to repeal were made you know, in the circumstances where there was no consultation. One was made under the military government to suppress the media. This one, Mr. Speaker, was brought into Parliament, and when it was, when after it was tabled, and like Honourable uh, Philippe Tuisawao, I opposed the bill on the basis that it was proper consultation was not done according to the Act, and we were holed up uh, from home during COVID in the night, taken to the police station, and I asked the same question. I said, this is my legitimate right as a member of parliament to talk about a bill that is before parliament. Why are you taking me for what? And, and Mr. Speaker, they said, sir, we can't tell you, but this is orders from the top. And many of us, and I was taken four or five times, I think. So Mr. Speaker, all we're doing using standing order 51 is to say those laws, the, the process through which they came in was wrong, it should have never been done, and we are simply saying this is going to be repealed. So it's not making a new law. If there, and and uh, Deputy Prime Minister, Honorable Kamkamida said that, that we are not going to abuse the use of Standing Order 51. We've said this. And, and, and I think the honourable members need to understand this and support the bill. Thank you. Thank you.